hi guys welcome back to another part of Photoshop tutorial in today's episode we are going to learn about another important tool available in Photoshop called the lasso tool the lasso tool is the useful components for making for make some freehand selection in an image so if you want to uh, make and make a if you want to make a freehand selection on an image then lasso tool is the best option so in toolbar this is Lasio tool. You can use the shortcut key L for accessing this Lasio tool. And you can change. Of course, there are three options are available on Lasio tool. First one is a normal option. Second one is a polygonal. And uh, final one is a magnetic Lasio tool. So, the basic function of Lasio tool is to make some freehand selection on, on your image. Or if you need some sharp selection on the image, then the Lasio tool is the better option so here I just choose the normal lasio tool and here I just create a freehand selection you can see I made a freehand selection here and after that two endpoints of the selection are coincide that the selection is made at okay now you can easily move the selection uh, lasio tool selection anywhere on the image use the movie tool and if you want to add another selection into the selection then just hold the shift key on keyboard and made a new selection now you can see the second selection that means the current selection is actually added into the previous selection so by holding shift key on keyboard you can made any number of selection and add that selection into the previous selection so and if you want if I, I just made a selection here and if you want to subtract some portion of this selection so simply just hold the alt key on your keyboard now you can see that a negative a minus sign is also associated with the mouse cursor and I just make a selection here now you can see that that selection is actually subtracted from the previous selection I made a selection here if I want to make another selection and I only need that intersection of the two selection then uh, you can hold the control and shift key on your keyboard now you can see that an into symbol is also is now associated with the cursor and now here I am going to make another selection now you can see only the intersections of the two selection is only remaining there you can easily done this option from this menu bar here this is the new selection by using that option you can choose any new selection and here uh, here is the add it to selection option I just use that option now you can see that without holding the shift key on your keyboard you can now make any number of selection and add those selection into the previous selection so here I made a new selection and automatically it is added into the previous selection now I made another so that is the use of this option add it to selection on the menu bar now here is the subtract from subtract from selection option I choose it now without holding the alt key on keyboard a negative symbol is already associated with the cursor now you can make any selection and that selection is actually subtracted from the previous selection okay now here is the multiple selection that means it is the intersect selection I just choose that option now you can make a new selection and only the intersection between the two selection intersection between the two selection is only remaining there okay now here is the polygonal lasso tool by using the polygonal lasso tool you can make a selection in the form of a polygon okay this is the use of polygonal lasso tool if you want to uh, select <coughs> an image that does not have curved surface uh, that means a plain image that does not that does not contain any curved surface then polygonal lasso tool is the uh, better option for the selection purpose okay now now here is the another lasso tool now the last lasso tool is the magnetic lasso tool so you can use the magnetic lasso tool for sharp selection suppose if you want to select some curved area on an image then the magnetic lasso tool is the better option suppose here 
I just going to select this image using Lasio tool you can see that you can easily select the curved surface using this magnetic Lasio tool that is the use of the magnetic Lasio tool okay now here I made the selection this is the use of Lasio tool guys thank you for watching see you in the next part of this tutorial